Hello everybody and welcome back to Tohu where we need to help these guys I think it's still telling me I need to help the snail let's go and talk to well can we talk to anyone can we talk to any of these guys I'll just try and do what I can um, oh yeah we can talk to, to this person in prison okay so yes, yes, I went searching for some reagents. Then bang, I was trapped. I can't get out of here by myself. Yes, yes, only science can help me now. Here's my secret recipe. Use it wisely. Wisely. Okay. Okay, so I take it this is the potion making machine. So let's go and see if we can make a potion. Now, it was orange, green, and red, wasn't it? So let's try and make it. Um, okay, we made orange. on them. Okay, yep. Green. Oh, I can reset it as well. Oops, I didn't entirely mean to reset it. Orange. One had like a fire on it and the others didn't. The orange one had a fire on, and then it was green. Can I? Oh, right. So I think what we actually might need, thinking about it properly, is hot orange, cold green, and cold red. Gosh, I need to check that. Don't click on that. That's a reset button. Okay, so that has made me a potion. Okay, let's give it back to this guy and we'll see if we've made the right kind. I wonder if I can pick that up. I'll have to see next time. Because um, it lo looks like you can't just see what's interactable. Unless you're stood on the same level. It's a bit annoying. Oh. Keep clicking on that fly. Oh, look, there's some berries there. Ah, oh, I'll keep them for later, I guess. Uh, also, I have not tried this machine yet. Okay. We get blue, blue stripey. Green wavy and red wavy hmm? red weird I, I yeah I don't really know what that's all about I'm gonna turn it off for now I'll give this guy his potion anyway because he's been waiting for that but I. Look, berry plus potion plus cup. There's a cup up there as well. So. Oh, look, he turned into the perfect shape to get out of prison. I don't say thank you or anything. Gee, so rude. Oh, yeah, so this one is to put snowflakes on the ones that are cold. So blue cold, warm uh, red, and then black, warm black as well. I was probably going to make this potion, I imagine. And then I need a cup. Okay. Let's pick up the cup. And then let's go make the potion. I don't know what I need to do with them. Maybe I can... I don't know. 
We'll make it first and then I'll try and work out what to do with it. So it was blue cold. Red warm. And then black warm. Black's usually all the colours combined, but we'll try it. I can always undo it if it's wrong. Oh no, that was exactly what I expected to happen. So blue, red, black. Yeah, that should be right. Okay. Um. And what have we got? We've got oh well, we've got the potion, the cup, and the berries. So I can interact with the food. Well, okay. Well let's see if we can put like the berries in the food. Can we do that? Yes. Oh, okay. Can we can we do anything else? Can we Oh, you can taste it as well. And the potion. Right, that worked. And the cup. Hmm. Okay. That didn't work. Now, the only thing we've done nothing with so far in this whole map is this thing. So I'm kind of wondering whether we need, like, magical water in the cup to put in here. And it's got, like, a squiggle. So I'm thinking the two ones that had squiggles on them, like that, were the green and the red. So I, I'll try the green first, and we'll see if we can get that to, to work. Oh, if you look really closely at the light bulbs, hang on. No. See, both the green, the blue has like a, the blue has a like a, a wavy form to it, whereas the, the green and the red have like jaggedy forms. Let's just try green. See if um we can fill the yeah we can fill the jug with green. All right, well let's um go up and see. Oh, I should have turned that off, shouldn't I? I hit that noise. Oh, like some weird kind of torture. Okay, so oh. Okay, well, let's try a different colour water. Has nothing happened. Let's try red. If red doesn't work, then we'll try blue, I guess. Okay, so that time, it, so they have different tags on depending on. That tag looks very similar, except it's got one more thing to it. Maybe it's right. We'll see. All right. Oh, he's refusing the food. Oh, yay! Go, go, dude with a trombone on your head. <laughs> Rah! And colander pants. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can see them get crossed off the wall as you put them in as well. That's a detail. That I had not noticed it as it was happening. Mm. Hello. Mr. Snail Dude. With a pipe organ on your back. Well, that's a whole one round bang going on, isn't it? So, once upon a time, our land was completely safe. But then dark times came upon us. Junkle, however, found a good use for the mechanisms. With them, he built the sacred engine. Okay. 
Good to know about Jungle. So Jungle built the Sacred Engine. You'd think Jungle could come over here and fix it for me, couldn't you? Okay. Let's head. Let's head on. Let's carry on. Ah, oh, you! Come back here! Okay, so what have we got here? That can be interacted with the snake. Let's click on all the animals. And that dude, and that dude, and that dude. There's my card, and that dude. And that's all the animals I can see. Got all sorts of weird and wonderful runes everywhere. That one can be clicked on. So can that, mm, like, mazy thing on the rock. We've got that poor dude that I would love to get. <laughs> okay, so we've got like a whole maze going on here. Wonderful. Alright, let's uh, see if we can do the maze. Uh... <laughs> Trial and error at that one. Okay. And apparently click on that as well. Um, that looks like I can click on it too. Let's try it. Try clicking on that. Oh, maybe you have to do it just at the right point. I don't know. Okay, so that symbol connects to that. That symbol connects to that. So can we see this symbol anywhere? I can't. Hmm. Alright. Well, we can climb on the pots as well, so let's try and do that. Hello, let's see if we go. Oh! Well, that's not very good, is it? Is there anything that... I have nothing in my bag that I can use to deal with that guy. I've got no scissors or anything like that. I guess we need to do something else first, then. Uh, come down, come down, come down. I can bang on that. Should we have a chat to this guy? Okay, so we sang the songs and enjoyed the rain. When this dome appeared and I was caught, my buddy was trapped in the centrifuge, insane. And the other one hid in a pot. Awesome poem. <laughs> okay, so that stops it. Left. Right. Let's try banging on this one twice. Okay. Okay. So we got uh, we got him out of his prison. All right. Mm. Don't know how what to do about the others though. So we got a pot, and we've got a flower that we can't get past. So, I'm thinking those two things may be connected. Right, okay. So, let's see what we've got here. So let's see if we can cover over that pot with this pot. Ah, we can. And that lets this guy get down. Hey, look at the symbols, the one we were looking for. Okay, so can I click on it? Yes! 
And it is now basically like glowing at me. So I'm kind of guessing I need to go and interact with it again. Alright, uh, okay, let's go click on you again. Oi! I thought you'd gone! Haha, <laughs> you're stuck on a judging fork! Oh! I'm back here with my mallet! And you broke my tools! with energy and light, it had an amazing capability. Sorry, this is going to be really, really quiet. Um, so you'll either need to, to read it or, or turn up the music really loud. <laughs> I don't know, but I, um, I don't have separate layers or anything, or I don't think it's even possible to have separate layers for the music and the sound effects. Um, I may be able to. Let's have a look at the settings quickly. Sound volume. No, we only have one set, one static sound volume and they've not really very well uh, balanced this. So when the totem was still whole, shining with energy and light, it had an amazing capability. To open the door into the unknown. To open the door into the unknown. Anyone who knew its secret could use this portal for their own purposes. Anyone who knew its secret could use this portal for their own purposes. The totem has been disassembled by the keepers, so it doesn't work now. I think it's gone louder. I, I don't know, it could be in my ears. But the totem's been disassembled by the keepers, so it doesn't work now. The keepers divided the pieces among themselves and parted. The keepers divided the pieces among themselves and parted. to their home. Each one to their homes. Okay, so sorry if that was uh, annoying to have it read out again, but I don't think that uh, necessarily everyone could hear that. I have to fix the totem as soon as possible. Perhaps I should start by visiting the illusionist. Okay, we can absolutely do that. Oh, off we go in my ship. In my bee copter. Of the fractured totem, the girl flies to visit the illusionist to bargain for the first missing piece. Okay, so we are absolutely illusionist. Hello, illusionist. Are you the illusionist? Oh, you're the illusionist. Give me that totem piece, please. Oh ho, no need to rush, child. So I'll solve my collection of conundrums first. The first will test your speed. The second will test your wisdom. And the third will activate, or sorry, will challenge your attentiveness. Solve them all and let me know when you are done. Oh ho ho. All right. So we've got like a, a puzzle here, a puzzle here, and a puzzle here, a mole, whack-a-mole one? Let's try whack-a-mole. Hmm? Okay. So we've got to be speedy, apparently. What? I'm the whack-a-mole? Oh, gosh. It'd be lovely if you could tell me the rules. I don't even know what the rules are. <laughs> Okay, I kind of get the idea now. Got to keep on the move. Doing so well. Two. There's going to be more than one thing, probably. I'm just going to keep clicking. It seems to work quite well. Oh, man. 
This is so long. Okay, we've done round two. Is there only three rounds? There's three rounds. Okay, let's go. Let's do this thing. Oh, do I go back to round one? Oh no, we start on round three. That is, that's very nice of it. quick enough not quick enough at all i want to keep an eye on these barrels and try and get the the one place where they're not ouch well that wasn't very good that was me trying too hard this is going to come down to luck i think I should have stayed where I was. Round three is hard. Stacks it's not stacked in my in my favour. No. Well, I do apologize for this one. luck if it happens so absolutely gonna be luck oh the shadows of course I was like, how do I get my advance warning? I know now that the shadows on the things show you where you need to move to. Right. I have a, I have a, a way to do this now. Oh. I'm still going to make mistakes, but I've got an actual way to, to work it out. So yeah, the shadows on the thing. Oh, <laughs> how you work it out. Oh no! Clicking where a shadow is is not the best thing to do. I will get this, don't you worry. Once I stopped trying to talk to you guys, it was a lot easier. I apologise for the, uh, the the uh, the quietness there, but I really needed to concentrate on that one. Even once I worked out the thing with the shadows on the squares, which does help immensely, um, it was still a bit tough. I may put a little cut in there and take some of the, the failed attempts out. Or not. I'll see how I feel. <laughs> okay, so next one. It's Mr. Rabbits. This is supposed to be wisdom, is it? Okay. Okay. those two I'll move 
use that one. That one use those two. So you, those two have moved together. That always moves along with that one. <laughs> this is the sort of thing I hate. It's not a good puzzle for me at all. Mr. Illusionist. That won't even move. Oh! Well, okay. I just carried on until eventually it just did its thing. That was, that was fluke. You can maybe try and copy what I did. <laughs> Kind of glad I got away with that one. So we've done two out of the three. So this one is uh, okay. Different things light up in different orders. Okay, this isn't as bad as the other ones. Okay, that was level one. Right, so I need to be a bit quicker off the mark, though, finding which one's which. Oh, okay. Look at where it wobbles. There, on the star. Come on. Why do I get the feeling the third level of this is going to be impossible? <laughs> oh, gee. Okay. I want to... Wobble, 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 wobble. Oh, come on. ones are undoing themselves. This is not funny. Yes, I did all the puzzles. Yes. That one was really hard though. The the whack-a-mole one. The third level of whack-a-mole was nasty. Nasty. Give me my totem piece, you. Give me that totem piece, please. Oh ho, no need to rush, child. Sell off my collection of conundrums first. But I did what you said. The first will test your speed. No, I did all of them. Solve them all and let me know when you're done. But I did them all. Do I need to like let the rabbit out the Oh okay. You've got to let the rabbit out of the cannon as well. Why didn't you say that? These are gonna tell me the order of what I've got to do, so 
That one. Um... No, that one. No one that looks like kind of like a coffee cup. That one. Sorry, rabbit. Oh, there's my totem piece. Wonderful. Thank you, illusionist. You better be taking that back to my... Back to my place. Okay. Totem piece number one. All done. Got a few minutes left of the episode, maybe 10 minutes left, so I'll see if I can do the next adventure. The illusionist's puzzles were tricky, but the girl managed to solve them all. After 400 the attempts. missing totem piece has been found. Two remain. Two remain. Okay. Right, so, we have landed in a swamp. Are you my card creature? Yes. Oh, you know what? I think they, I don't think we've got a card creature in the illusionist's place. Oh, well. Okay, so people say that long ago the keepers quarreled and drifted apart. Each of them flew home, taking a piece of the totem with them. Poor old Junker was left alone with Cubus's head. Oh, along with Cubus's head. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. There's another shooting one. I assume. Alright. But those things keep breaking, so I don't think that that's quite right. So shoot, shoot. Oh, okay, we've got to shoot at the right parts. And make maybe a bridge or something? I see. Needs to be like right above there, so let's see. I can just. That wasn't quite right. Oh, I'm not so close. Hmm. No. One got there. Okay. Well, I get the idea. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's nothing else I can interact with this there, so this is clearly what I have to do. I have to get it in exactly the right spot. Ooh. Not easy. I'm guessing I need to kind of get it to land there, but... Hmm? Not as simple as it seems. 
It's going to be another one that's going to be a huge amount of luck. Ah, okay. That's you sorted. No. I have no aim. <laughs> at all. Close, but no cigar. Super close. Still no cigar. Oh, it's really close as well. Got to be really... Yes, I get that we need to build a bridge, yes. <laughs> mm. That was really close too. No, I was, I was trying to do the shooty thing. I wasn't... It doesn't help when it doesn't shoot when you're asking it to and it's doing other things. I didn't even hit it. Let's try and see if we can get this bit of the bridge finished. Bit over here. Oh, very close again. But you've got to be really precise. That's not really my forte. No. <sighs> These manual tasks. Okay, we've got one more piece in. It'll happen eventually, just through sheer, like, luck more than judgment, won't it? At least once you do one bit, the other bits, like, stay put, you know? Okay, I totally messed that up. I was trying to time it, but I don't think trying to time it actually helps. I am extremely sorry I suck so much at this. You think they might a little bit slide into place, but no, no, they have to fall exactly into place. Well done, that's the last bit of that bit done. Just got this one to do now, so I can concentrate on this. Yeah, it was too, one was too early, one was too late. Very close. I had to shoot twice, so that was never going to work. Come on, just one more to do. this one is where I'm like trying to get things to happen it's so close to all of the menus the menu options and stuff that I worry I'm gonna click on a menu option instead of like my being able to just concentrate on my mosquito -y fly thing Go! Yes! It did it! Aha! Wonderful mosquito bridge builders. 
Alright, um, so can I go across the bridge now? Yes. And can I pick up this pipe? Can Cubus pick it up? No. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool. So there are two bridges. And because I finished both bridges, I'm allowed to go between the two areas. Back and forth. But I think that that, my friends, is going to be the end of the episode there because... Because... Other than the fact that I'm probably going to have to cut out loads of uh, the stuff at the illusionist's place. Um, <laughs> I'm going <laughs> to... I might not. I might show you the full frustration of like all 10 minutes of, of trying to do that puzzle. <laughs> I'll have to see. But yeah, um, other than that, we, we're at the sort of 45 minute mark now. So I am going to do the rest of this swampy business uh, next episode. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more Tohu, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.